How's it going everyone? Thanks for coming out and checking out the new video today. We're going to be going over batch naming and renaming files using a program called Automator. So let's dive in and check it out. So we've got 227 files here and, uh, and we want to rename them. So rather than going through and individually naming them, which we could do if we wanted more specific names, but in this case, if we just want to label them sequentially or in some other manner, uh, we can use a program called Automator. So if you pull that up, uh, it's going to make the uh, situation much easier. So when it opens up, you get this uh, screen here. You can just go ahead and click Workflow. And you're going to go over here on the left to Files and Folders. And then inside of that, you want to rename Finder Items. So click this and drag it over to the right. And drop. Go ahead and hit Add. So here, you've got a series of options for what you can do when you want to rename your folder. So in this case, uh, just go ahead and exit that, click uh, out of this copy finder items box here, the little X mark, and then go into your folder, select everything, and bring it right above the rename finder items. So now you have all of your 227 files right here, and it's going to filter into uh, the rename finder item task within Automator. So here you've got a drop down that'll let you choose. You can add text, you can change case, make sequential, you can do a whole bunch of things. Um, in this case, the, the technique I'll show you is make sequential. So click on that, and you've got more options here. So. Do we want to add a number to the existing item, which would just be this MVI underscore and then a number? No, we want to give it a new number. So here we'll do um, batch rename, and then we'll have the number go after that, just to show you how it works. So place the number after name or before name. We'll do after name. We'll start the numbers at 1, and we'll separate them with an underscore. You could do any choice that you want. And then you could do make all numbers two digits long if you want. So you have a 0, 1, 0, 2, so forth. Um, so we'll do that just so they stay consistent. We'll actually do three digits because it's good. we have 200 clips. And, uh, and here you can see an example of what it's going to look like. So watch this. All our settings are correct. You can see the files over here. So if we hit run, instantly it's going to rename all of our files using that numbering system. So definitely check out Automator. It's a great program. It makes for a lot of help when you're uh, doing various tasks within Finder or anywhere in your computer. And this is just one simple way to uh, batch name or rename a bunch of files. So I, I appreciate you watching. Give the video a like and uh, please check back soon. Thanks guys. Have a good one.